okay, I'm just gonna have to do this. Um, I was sitting at my table. I had already made the first video. Um, and I was like, okay, I need to make a second one. So I went to my table. I was like, this is serious. Like, this is serious. Like, I'm always struggling to get it together. It's a long story. Lord Jesus, please help me. Um, and I cannot deliver, you know, what the Lord says to me unless I'm like completely 100% um, sure. It's weird. It's like the, the inequity of time, the fulfillment, like the Lord said in the Bible one time, their, their inequity is not reached fulfillment. And um, I did a video on it actually yesterday that I have not posted about how um, the Lord spoke to me. It's a whole story anyways. And my friends were like, you should have already, you know all the signs. And I'm like, I don't care. I've already been, I've gotten all of the confirmations from the Lord Jesus, from the Bible, from, um, you know, everything. And, um, but I know it's not, he's not finished speaking. So anyways, this, that's a whole other topic. I'm talking about, stay focused. Lord Jesus, help me stay focused. Um, this is the second follow-up to the first video. I'm going over... And I'm a little bit adjusted right now in my posture because my first video was very, um, very serious in my heart about the, the people on YouTube, the Lord Jesus' people, um, prophets, that's very much a, t a trendy term right now, prophetic voices, um, you know, the Lord's servants, um, I'm in that myself. And so the Lord, um, like I said in the first video, I watched thousands of videos. The Lord brought me to YouTube two years ago. And um, the Lord, I've never seen authentic testimonies like I have seen on, on YouTube. So, uh, literally the Lord brought, I had a, a little revelation just about an hour ago. Because um, I'm always struggling to figure out what I'm supposed to be saying because there's so much going on. And so, um, the Lord really wanted me to talk about the trends and the voices on YouTube because it's crazy. I watched so much and I've even repented of it and taken off uh, and done fasts of them. But I always come back to just doing these I've, and I've studied it for so long. I've watched YouTube for like these voices. Um, and what is the Lord saying? Because my calling is to study the Lord's voice and trust me, I've, I'm always studying it because I've got a lot of un big question marks in my life. So like Martin Luther, when he joined the Augustinian Observant, Augustinian Friars, where he actually observed every single thing to the hundredth, hundredth, I'm watching every single thing, every single, if the Lord is breathing on something, any even a breath, I'm, I'm on it. Um, because I'm always needing direction and also just love the Lord Jesus' presence. I'm obs I want to literally be in the Lord's presence all the time. Anyways, so the Lord put on my heart and it was kind of a difficult thing to explain. Um, but tonight I was going through YouTube and I was just like, man, I can't ignore it tonight. Every single video is, and I made a list. And the Lord was like, make a list. And um, these are the topics that are on YouTube. And I've, like I said in the first video, you have to watch it. These trends um, that have been happening since five years ago when I had an encounter with Christ. And he told me I was going to be a voice friend. This is what I'm seeing over and over and over. Your spouse has been released. It's happening suddenly, any minute now. Um, and this is by multiple people. It's time. Re this is my favorite. Release uh, receive your promised land. Um, your, your spouse is being released. That's my favorite. Um, it's your turn. Um, uh, your promise has arrived. And so, look, the Lord has made it very clear to me. And I can list examples, but I don't have time. I've got to get this out. There are always exceptions in the Bible. No one knows what the Lord is speaking to you except for you. I repent if I am wrong of this, and I pray in the name of the Lord Jesus, and he knows my heart. I don't have time to go into it, that he would convict me if I'm wrong. But, watch the first video. We have to be careful of guarding others' hearts. And in my spirit, I feel like 
some of the, and I think that they are well-intentioned believers. That's why, that's my perception. They're well-intentioned believers, but we're starting to see just a, it's a, these type of regurgitated, I mean, repeated over and over. I mean, I've been seeing this for years, but especially, it's just like, I can just tell like, and I, and I take time to watch the videos because I'm like, you know what? I want to watch and see. Just I just want to confirm that I'm feeling this, you know? And it's just like it's happening suddenly. Your spouse is being released. That type of word that says your spouse is being released. Unless you have some type of testimony, confirmation of this word in detail, um, I think that is a very, very careful you need to be careful that to me personally almost all the time should be a one-on-one -on -one personal word to someone because you are speaking to the mass okay um and there are a lot of people who have been um a heart the heart heart matters of the heart is a very serious thing that's why the lord says to guard it so i'm just going to say proceed with caution to those of you who are making these videos with these titles this suddenly is happening now the release is happening now. You're walking into your promised land. Um, I've just seen so many like, please, if you are releasing those, please make, I mean, be authentic. I mean, have some type of details. And I think the best thing is to have testimony. Like the Lord is glorified through testimony. We overcome by the blood of a lamb and the word of our testimony. And like I said in the first video, I went over the characteristics of the what I have seen as regarding the most prophetic utterances in my life come through these testimonies of people talking just about what the Lord did yesterday. And like I said, I've made a list of the people. Um, and I want to mention Esther, Esther's way. I have to mention this because when I went to sit down to write this list, she hit me like a ton of bricks and I'm not going to lie. I was shaking. Like my heart is actually still beating. I wasn't expecting it it just came on my phone I was I was very focused on this I was like oh my gosh I literally was like shaking she made a video and it popped up my phone about smoke alarms I literally got visions of smoke alarms going off today I made a video on August 21st when I was doing a documentary at my church regarding our prayer garden and I was documenting things at the church and I literally made a 30 something second video because there was smoke alarm going off in the, in the room I was in and the Lord has kept on telling me about smoke alarms. But specifically today, I got two flash visions of it and her video happened to pop up today about the smoke alarm. And then she went into saying that, um, marriages and you are getting married. Now I cannot talk about there's a back personal story regarding that that I cannot release. You know, I can't talk about that. It's the Holy the Holy Spirit has not released me to talk about that. Now Esther, is, I'm not gonna lie. The Lord has confirmed things that today was not the first thing. He has confirmed crazy things. She said that I'm just like, oh my gosh, this is crazy. But today took the cake. Today took the cake with the smoke alarm, and she ended it with saying the marriage is happening. Now I'm gonna say this. Like, I agree with her. I made a video yesterday. I did not release it. And I was talking about an experience at Buffalo Wild Wings, Table 523, about how the Lord spoke to me and how I went to extreme matters to make sure that the Lord, I, I, I cannot say the Lord is going to do something unless I'm 100%, like the fulfillment is there. Like, I'm satisfied in my soul with the Lord has completed the word. I know when the Lord is finished speaking and when he's not. He could give me a thousand million signs, but... And in the word of God, I mean, like for real, he's, he will tell me in all different ways, like Gideon, but I don't care if there, if I'm not fulfilled, it's hard to explain. If he has not completed the sentence, I know, but when he does, I know it. When he's completed it, I know it because it only happened twice. So, um, Esther felt like she was able to say that, that the Lord was saying marriages and you're getting married, you're getting married. Now, because of what I've seen in her, I would testify that she's hearing from the Lord. I mean, it's, there's just been so many confirmations between me personally. Now, that is a word that I, I, I couldn't go as far as she did. I was with her the whole time. But when she said that, I was like, whoa, I, could, I couldn't say that on um, 
I can't say that. Like, this whole video I just made before I watched her video was, y'all be careful of these these videos that you're making. Hers is different, though. I'm not, she's not the one I was even talking about before. I was talking about the ones that were, like, just very vague, and I'm just seeing all the time, you're suddenly is coming, whatever. I wasn't talking about her. It was just crazy how the smoke alarm video popped up as I was making this. And then, um she talked about your marriage and she was bold about it it's like she was like 100 percent. the the lord is you are getting married okay i'm gonna leave that alone well i'll leave that alone i just said i'm not permitted i don't i'm not full i don't have the fullness of that completed sentence that's a long story but i want to talk about the the ones and the i made a list lord it's like really like a i want to just like grab for the gratefulness that I have in these testimonies, when I talk about the Spirit of the Lord um, and how prophetic these testimonies are, and they're just every day like me, normal people. Um, I'm, I made a list of ones that have just took, stood out to me over time that the Lord has just spoken so loud, and they are just the most random things. I'm serious. But the Lord, um, I also want to read Esther 4 too, but he went only as far as the King's Gate. Because no one clothed in sackcloth was was allowed to enter it. Now, this to me, I'm not going to get into this. There is levels of the of the inner kingdom of like the Lord, and I, the Bible says that the the there the Lord does nothing without revealing it to His prophets, the friends of God. He tells His plans. To me, these are the friends of God, <laughs> like because they've. It's just so much. Um, I don't know. It's just how I feel. Number one, Shandy Shandy. She did a um, video of several dream uh, about a dream house. Um, she did uh, these oil, this oils for free video. The she uh, there's a video she's dead called Fall, I fell on my face. The Lord spoke to me. Um, she took some of these off, which I was so disappointed um, because I. But I did. It's crazy. I understood her because I actually did the same thing. I have literally. She under, if she's watching, which I pray in the name of the Lord Jesus, she is. Um, I actually have done that. And that's all I'm going to say. I've taken off so many videos. I've disappeared before because I got freaked out. Um, but please bring those videos back if you can. Like, they're so special to me. Um, this girl. And anyways, uh, confirmation from the bank. And then the Lord is so good. She came on two weeks ago. I mean, I watched it last night. I was so happy that she was back. Like, I was, I literally was like, oh my gosh, Shandy's back. And I've watched thousands of videos. I'm a YouTube, I'm on the Watchtower. Like, I really believe the Lord has given me the job of following His voice on YouTube and and calling out the trends um, and kind of keeping a watch on, like, what is the Lord seeing? Is there a trend? Are there patterns? Um, so, number two, I'm just, I'm just, they're not in any particular order. Um, Lorena Speaks. I'm not even going to drop the mic on Lorena Speaks. Too much. That girl. I'm, I, I got shook. Shook. Uh, on that. On those. Um, I'm still shook about those. Lorena Speaks. She did one. Um, and I made a list of it. Lorena Speaks. Something big is coming in all caps. Then she did one that was called. Not. She wasn't even fasting or in prayer at that time. Um something big is coming in all caps she also did another one that um i can't even say the title of but in due time maybe i'll be able to that shook me to my core i was literally shaking when i watched it um because the lord jesus was speaking to me um place of healing ministries about the the rainbow in her in her house oh my gosh um testimonies of the Lord. All of this gives glory to the Lord and is so prophetic. I mean, it's the little things. Sh Shana Mar Oglivy. Shana Mar Oglivy. The, my testimony of Jesus Christ. That was, He was the first one I ever watched. I, I mean, just watch it. Dustin, one of my friends in California. Dustin. Uh, fab. I'll have to give you all the correct spelling. Um, the Lord actually... I, we actually got to actually talk on the phone um, at Pentecost, and the Lord brought us into a great friendship, and now he's engaged. Anyways, um, his testimony about how he came to know the Lord as an atheist. Um, dedicated Zippy. Um, when she did her video on um, 
career list video, the Lord told her to make a list. And she even thought it was weird. She's like, why am I making this? Of all the careers that she had. Um, I just want to say I can't go into detail about that. But um, the Lord Jesus spoke so... You don't even know how that blessed me. I, I have not had felt that happy in a long time. But that's from the Lord. Um, Alexandria Herod did, did one called, I didn't eat food for 12 days. This was a detailed for real fast. This is, this girl did this fast. It I mean, the Holy Spirit confirmed wonderful acts, wonderful acts, wonderful acts, wonderful acts. Um, you were, you overcome by the blood of the lamb and the word of your testimony. The idols Vespa video. I watched that so many times. Um, and none of it was from a long time ago. The Amanda L. Hill channel did one called The Makeup Testimony. And it literally, like the Lord Jesus, just Holy Spirit came all over me in that. It was the most beautiful analogy of how the Lord... Y'all, please watch her makeup testimony. It's the Amanda L. Hill. Like, you would think that's random, but the Lord was giving an analogy through her. She was talking about a day she did her makeup, and it was looking crazy. Then at the end, it looked, like, amazing. Um, uh, Esther, okay, okay. And so, prophesying in part, I kind of want to go over this. The first time something new, this is the first time I'm doing something kind of new with the smoke alarm. Um, I believe that the Lord has given us YouTube as a community, and... Um, the Lord is wants to connect the ones that His te- His Spirit has testified um, and confirmed things things through. And tonight, like I said, I'm very. I just want to go ahead and say, like with the smoke alarms, uh, Esther's way, that was the icing on the cake for. It says in the Bible, there is a tried stone, like you're tried and tested and purified through fire, and we must test the spirits. Well. I, that's, that's a process of testing. So if I say that I believe very, very strongly in the Holy Spirit, that I'm being led by the Holy Spirit as all the confirmations line up, um, I feel very confident in saying that this took the cake and the smoke alarm thing. I pray right now in the name of the Lord Jesus that somehow the Lord is going to use us in part to talk about the smoke alarm thing. I, it, the Lord never gave me the interpretation. I never got that anything dangerous was happening. Um, I actually did not. Actually, I think I might have, but I'm not sure. Um, because Esther's way, she seemed very sure of like smoke alarm was like destruction or something. I never got the interpretation. All I know is that like the Lord is showing me smoke alarm. Like it's a sign. Like it's a sign. And I can't go into all the detail about that, about what I mean. Um, but, um, I think that on, like I said, the Lord is connecting. He's connecting those, um, on YouTube that um, testify with the spirit of the Lord Jesus to each other, certain people to do his, confirm his word, prophesy in part. Um, and I believe that we're going to see prophecies like my, my Pat, my godmother that gave me this Esther's, Esther's prayer shawl. She said that she was prophesied to, and this is what um, I actually saw my friend Dustin do in California over the phone, that there there will be couples, not only couples and marriages, but also I believe like evangelism partners in the body of Christ like now, they will start to a prophesy and then they will be, fin- the other person will finish the prophecy. Like, and I mean ones like, not just marriages, I believe marriages as well, but on YouTube, like, like this, like there will be a finishing of it. Like I could get one part of it and you get the other. There are some of these, like, like I said, Lorena Speaks, she has one that I can't talk about yet, but there's no way in the world that she, she, she talked about a dream. There's no way in the world, there's just no way in the world that she would know that, like, I've never even spoken to her. The Lord is giving words and, it, and the other, and giving other people that, and YouTube is being used, um, and In the most just obscure, simple, crazy ways that you would never even know. Like only the Spirit of the Lord can confirm. Um, The Lord uses whatever He wants. 1 Corinthians 10, 27 says He uses the foolish things. He uses the the things that are despised, the things that are not. The things that don't even exist He uses um, to shame the wise. 
So, um, I just love that verse. So, I praise the Lord Jesus. And I just want to say again, to those that are just, please be sure. Um, and whatever you're saying, just make sure you're giving. Because, I, like I said in the first video, I believe that these, these I say, regurgitated title videos... Um, that are very generic. Um, I believe that the that these are believers in the Lord Jesus with well intentions, but from someone who has been like walking this for a while, like I was very like um, disappointed for a while when I first got delivered, and the Lord told me some things that um, did not happen the next day. Like I would get these all these videos break through this break through that it's coming in the mail it's coming tomorrow and so i'm very sensitive to the body of christ and um guard in their heart because i went through that and didn't have anybody i didn't have anybody to talk to about it because i didn't i wasn't even in church at the time the lord delivered me in a office at night you know i didn't know anybody that had heard from the lord like that so all i had was periscope and youtube videos and so anyways i'm just very protective of the body of christ so um, be very careful of um, when you prof when you make those titles and um, they're just generating a so much on on YouTube right now. Just um, not like, like I said, if you have a specific word about that, like uh, X Esther is a great example with all the details and like it's just very obvious like that the Lord is speaking. Like I don't know, I just I just it's confirmed. Um, but I'm interested to see about the marriage part of that. Because like I said, I would not be able to release that yet. Um, that's where I would have, like, that's where I would have stopped. But if the Lord has given her that, then honey girl, baby girl, go ahead. So, um, I'm very interested and actually excited to see, um, about that. And the smoke alarm. So, praise the Lord Jesus. I pray that this gets to who it needs to get to. And whoever has an ear, let them hear. And Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. And there's no one under heaven and earth to call on to be saved except Jesus Christ. That's Acts 4.12. And I'm talking so fast because I don't have much time on my phone. And I want to get through this video. So praise the Lord Jesus. All glory and honor is to Him. All glory and honor goes to Him. All of it. Praise the Lord.